In this video, we're going to look at file and disk based redirection using FS Logics within Nerdio Manager for Enterprise 4.5. This is a native FS Logics feature which we've had requests from customers to implement and therefore have implemented as part of our 4.5 release to allow for the redirection of, of specific files or folders or registry entries for a user uh, when they connect to a session host. This can be very useful in situations where, for example, you have uh, you don't have a shared licensing model for an application. You need to redirect a user to a specific license for that user or their department. Um, and this way, the different users can receive different licensing based on their group membership. In order to configure this feature, we need to edit the installed applications on the host pool. And you can see that within my environment, I have two uh, license redirects. Please forgive the British spelling of license. And currently these are both disabled. And if I show you briefly what these functions look like, you can see we've got a very simplistic redirect of uh, an existing folder on the host called licenses to a disk file license vhdx and in the other example we have a file redirect so a redirection of a source file of c drive licenses license.txt to our destination of sales license. So any application, any function within the desktop that was attempting to call license.txt will be re redirected to this destination sales license.txt file. Now you can see that we are inside our session host with our license files which live within C Windows licenses Oh, sorry, it's the licenses. And within this, we have the standard license file, all the ones. We have an accompanying sales license file, all the twos. And without the FS Logix rules in place, they're currently not enabled. Uh, we are not seeing any redirection of our searches against these files. So if an application, for example, was browsing for the file license.txt, it would find this file with all the ones contained. Using the FS Logix tool, we are going to force a redirection within the operating system uh, to the sales license file and also to a disk, which we have located um, on a network share. And to enable this functionality, we simply find our two rule sets that we looked at previously. License disk redirect and license file redirect. And I'm going to choose apply to all hosts. And after a few minutes, these rules will have applied and we can test them. So from this view, we can see how these rules apply. So we can see that the license disk, so the redirect to a disk file, is applying to a single account, Toby Test, and the sales file license redirect is applying to Toby Skerritt, two separate accounts for which I've got two sessions open. So if we look first at the file redirection, you can see that in the environment, we can see, see that both files still appear to exist. However, we have a transparent redirect in place, whereby if any function tries to open the license.txt file, you can see we receive all the twos, which is actually the content of the sales license file. So what we're doing here is transparently redirecting the content um, or the, the request for license to sales license.
similarly with a disk redirect, we, in this instance, are redirecting a folder to a disk location. So on the session host itself, this folder contains two files, license and sales license. We can see that in this instance, it contains a finance license. And finance contains all of the nines. So again, we are redirecting a folder location to provide access to a file that would not natively be available on the host. And obscuring an existing folder licenses, which does exist on the host. I hope this video has been useful. Thank you very much for your time, and we hope to see you again. Thank <music> you.